If you're looking for the best, Waffle Maker here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have Cuisinart WAFO 100 Vertical Waffle Maker. Don't be put off by the Cuisinart Vertical Waffle Maker's funky design. In this case, Cuisinart really did reinvent the wheel. This unusual appliance turns out crispy, tender round waffles, eliminates overflow once and for all, and doesn't hog counter space. Not to mention that it's very reasonably priced. To fill this machine, just pour batter into the spout on top. It's easy to see when there's enough, and if there's any extra, it bakes up in the spout without making a mess by flowing onto the countertop. Both the green light and an audible sound signal when the machine is hot enough to pour in the mix, and again when your food is ready. The non-stick plates also made removing the cooked waffles easy. As this machine stands vertically, you can leave it on the back or side of the counter so you don't have to sacrifice much counter space or stash it away. The machine comes with a measuring cup, which helps ensure you're using exactly the right amount of batter. Our top pick also provides a booklet with quite a few enticing recipes, including toppings. Moving on to the next, number two with Hamilton Beach 26,009 Belgian Style Waffle Maker. For the money, you just can't beat the Hamilton Beach Belgian Style Waffle Maker. It bakes up to crispy, fluffy, perfectly thick waffles in record time. Without a doubt, this is not a fancy model. It lights up when it's time to add the batter and remove the waffles, but it doesn't make a sound. The settings lever slides from minimum to maximum, but there are no specific numbers in between. Despite that, it makes two at a time. It's fairly compact and won't take up too much room on the counter or in a cabinet. The number three position is held by Breville BWM640 XL Smart Waffle Pro 4 Slice. Let's put it on the table right away. $200 is a lot of cash to spend for this kind of appliance. You can get perfectly wonderful waffles from other machines, but if you want to bake four at a time, and get the ultimate inconvenience, the handsome well-designed Breville the Smart Waffle Pro is worth the big bucks. Batch after batch come out exactly the same extra crispy on the outside and tender on the inside. And the Breville's waffles are the only ones we taste tested that stay crunchy if they're not devoured immediately. In addition to done this level, there are settings for five types classic, Belgian chocolate, buttermilk, and a custom one of your own devising. All of the settings are displayed on a large LCD screen that adjusts with a pair of knobs. The whole panel lights up to indicate when the irons preheated and when the waffles are fully cooked. There's a beep as well. As the waffle bakes, its countdown timer allows you to have an idea when to call everyone to the table. The Smart Waffle Pro takes a relatively long to bake, but as they say, good things are worth waiting for. And of course, it turns out for at once. On the Breville, there's a large professional type handle that keeps your hand well away from the machine's body to minimize any chances of burns. Around the grid, there's a deep moat that catches excess batter, so unless you really overdo it, you want it overflows onto your counter. This is a large heavy machine that doesn't stand on end for storage. You won't want to be lifting it in and out of a cabinet often, so you do need to have countertop space to dedicate to it. That's another reason, in addition to the hefty price that this is a machine for die-hard waffle lovers. Next at number four, we have Breville BWM520 XL No Mess Waffle Maker. You can depend on the Breville the No Mess Waffle for thin, crispy waffle rounds. One waffle at a time, after another, after another. Until our most recent round of testing, this was our favorite waffle maker for classic waffles. We love that this brushed stainless steel waffler has a moat around the waffle grid that catches any excess batter so there's never any run over on the counter or the machine itself making it truly no mess. It lights up and beeps when it's hot enough for baking and again when your waffle is ready. But we wish the beeps were louder they would be easy to miss in a noisy kitchen. After breakfast, you can latch the grids together and store it on its side to have more room to prep for the next meal. The number five position is held by Cuisinart WAF F20 Double Belgian Waffle Maker. If you love waffles, it's worth giving the large Cuisinart Double Belgian Waffle Maker some of your precious counter real estate. In our first round of testing, we awarded it the best Belgian waffle maker because it makes the kind of waffles dreams are made of thick, fluffy, and tender on the inside, and crunchy on the outside. Plus, it bakes two at a time. After adding batter to one chamber, rotate it in its frame, fill the other side, and rotate it again. 
lights and tone signal when each one is done. Unlike less expensive flip machines, this one feels solid and well built. It also comes with a 3 slash 4 cup measure for batter. The number 6 position is dominated by Cuisinart WMR CA Round Classic Waffle Maker. There's a lot to love about the Cuisinart Round Classic Waffle Maker. It heats up and bakes much faster than others in our testing group. And it was one of the few that gave a very distinct range of shades from light to dark, although it's beyond me why anyone would want their waffles pale and flappy. Not only is the appliance itself small and thin, it stands up for storage and the cord can be wrapped in the bottom. While there's a light to indicate that it's ready for the batter, and when waffles are fully baked, there's no sound so you have to keep an eye on it. We think that's a small drawback for a waffle maker this good and this inexpensive. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Dash Mini Maker Waffle. It doesn't get more adorable than this. Both the Dash Mini Maker Waffle Machine and the baby cakes it turns out are super cute. We think it would be perfect for making yourself or a junior waffle lover a small treat. It preheats and bakes up quickly so you can easily churn out a short stack. For the price, you don't get any fancy features, there are no settings. Just a blue light that goes off when the iron is preheated and again, when waffles are done. You might want to give it another minute or so if you prefer your waffles extra crispy. It's available in seven colors. The number eight position is held by Presto 3510 Flipside Belgian Waffle Maker. Unlike most flip style makers, the Presto Flipside Belgian Waffle Maker doesn't take up a lot of space when it's not baking waffles. It is slim and sits low on the counter and it can easily be locked into place so it can stand up for storage. However, you do need to make sure you have room on the countertop to flip it completely over on its side after you fill it with batter. Rather than specific browning settings, the Presto has a timer that you set by pushing a tiny button. It is designed to beep with only two minutes remaining, but often, at that point, it didn't beep and stopped counting down. Nonetheless, it produced evenly browned. Crispy waffles one after another, and it is the least expensive Belgian-style waffle maker on our list. Next at number 9, we have Chef's Choice 830B Waffle Pro Taste Slash Texture Select. Do you live in a house divided between crispy and not so crispy waffle lovers? The Chef's Choice Waffle Pro Taste Slash Texture Select Classic Belgian model has a unique control design to let you choose either crispy waffle with a moist interior or one with a uniform texture. It takes a little experimentation to realize for a crispy waffle you should select the uniform texture in spite of its name. The other setting doesn't provide much crunch. In addition, the Waffle Pro doesn't consistently produce evenly brown waffles. And, in spite of the word Belgian in its name, it doesn't make particularly thick or fluffy waffles. On a positive note, it bakes quickly so you can serve up a crowd without long waits between waffles. Both alight and alert you when it's time to pour in the batter and then, when it's time to serve the waffles. This model is slim and stands up so it can be conveniently stashed away between uses. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Chefman Anti-Overflow Belgian Waffle Maker. Chefman Anti-Overflow Belgian Waffle Maker consistently baked up beautiful waffles when we used a batter made from a packaged mix. When we used a batter made from a recipe, it faltered. At both preheating and waffle making, this was one of the speediest machines. Around the waffle grid, there's a channel to catch any excess batter, but even though we used the included measuring cup, batter still ran out of the machine and onto the counter. While there is a light to tell you when to fill it up and remove your waffles, there's no tone, so you need to check on it when it's baking. That's all for today. We upload product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.